another video. This video is gonna be about my do-rag collection. As you can see, I got a lot of do-rags. And to be honest, I wear a different do-rag every day when I go to school. Everybody be saying, why you got so many do-rags? Why you got so many do-rags? It's because I like wave and I like do-rags. I like wearing a lot of do-rags. I don't like wearing the same color do-rag every day, you know? So let's get straight to it. Okay, so as y'all know, as y'all know, right here, this is a velvet new rag. You know, it's pretty nice. I wear it sometimes when I'm not trying to compress, when I'm just looking for fashion or something like that, I wear it, you know. I got this by Ray by Kiss. They got some good cheap do rags that actually give you good, some good compress. So go check them out. You can go to any beauty salon and you'll find some. You know, Chinese shop. Um, Number two, actually, I was just wearing this before I started. I, was, uh, I did this video. I didn't burst, so I'm at the burst. Um, this is a great do rag, great silky satin. Um, reminder: all my do rags are from Red Box Kids because they're so cheap and they're so they they actually pretty good. You know, they got, it's got a long tail and everything. It was a long. So you won't have no problem. It fits all sizes of the head. So you won't have no type of problem putting it on. That's two. Three. Everybody call this the, the Adidas do-rag. You know, it looks like an Adidas do-rag with the stripes. You know, so I wear this sometimes. I don't wear it as much as I used to, but ain't nothing new to it. It's just really just that a poly do-rag. So, number, number four. It's a little purple. I call this the Mumba. You know, representing Kobe. I like this do rag a lot. This is probably one of my favorite do rags out of all of my collection so far. Um, I use them for washing sometimes, good compress. All that, all my do rags are from Red by Kiss. <clears throat> I don't wear this do rag, but I'm going to go ahead and tell y'all about it. Um, this is number five. I actually got this as a gift from my mom because she uh, knew I was starting my wave journey, so she just gave me a do rag. I never really wore it because the, the tails are uneven so it's kind of hard to actually put it on and to tie it because my head's big so yeah that was number five number six um this is a little whitey poly a white poly do rag that i used to wear for just you know fashion and i kind of do wear for fashion a lot but it's starting to get dingy so um i just i like wearing it so it's just for fashion because let me tell y'all why. This is the one. This is the silky I used to use. This is my first ever do rag. This is number seven. This is my first ever do rag. Um, for now, I mean right now actually, I just used it for washing. It's, it's just it's dirty, so you know, and it's dingy, so I don't I can't use this at school. I mean I can't if I wanted to, but I got that's where I got that other white poly from for, so. Number eight, favorite color is the royal blue. You know, I really love this color. This color is nice. Got a long tail. Great about this. Check them out. Ten. They're nice. They got a lot of do rags. They got a lot of color do rags. Um, it's nice. Number eight. I actually got this as a gift to my as my mom. From my mom also. It's just it's the little pink poly do rag, you know. It's pretty nice. I like it. Okay, you know, and they're all pink. So I wear it sometimes. I ain't no problem with me. I wear it sometimes. Number nine, I believe. And this is my red do rag. This is actually this was actually my second do rag ever getting. But I had kind of had a problem 
well, this is my second do rag ever buying, so I kind of had a problem with it. It had a little tear in the top where the stitches are, so I had to get another one. So this is um, a duplicate of the other one, basically. So it's really nice. I like red. And you can see I'm wearing red. I like red. It's nice. Second favorite color. Number 10. We're not gonna talk about this do-rag, because this do-rag is, it's, it's not, it's not long enough. Look at that, it's not, it's not long enough. I can't, I can't just, I can't just tie it, it's not really, it's not long enough. So, it's for smaller heads. Number 10. I have more do-rags in my bag. I think I got like two more in my bag, so. We get that to that in a minute. This is the navy, navy blue. Yeah, navy blue. I recently just bought this, not too long ago. I like it a lot. It is the color and the sensation, the, the, the feeling. You know, the feeling is nice. <sighs> Let me get this do rag real quick. Okay, so this is in my bag. The last time I wore this was probably like Tuesday. I wore this Tuesday. And I actually just bought this. This is my last one that I actually bought. It's nice. I like it. The tail is long. The tail is long and it's, it's flat. Because it's just flat. That's pretty good. You want to have a little big old line on your forehead. Make sure you put it inside out. Or you get a line through your waist on the top. Yeah. But yeah. This is my last do-rag, I believe. Um, I use all these do-rags. Maybe I use this for washing one day. But... I got another video soon. Trust me, I got one next Friday. This Friday coming up. Um, it's about a certain, about a certain thing. You know, a detangler, detangler brush. I read my kid. Go check them out. They're pretty good. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm gonna be using this while I wash my hair, washing style. So definitely my next video. Stay tuned. And. I will be back with another video. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. You already know. Sick.